OECD.AI is an online tool that lets policymakers, businesses, workers, technologists, academics and citizens share and shape artificial intelligence policy. Its main purpose is to ensure that AI is trustworthy and beneficial for everyone. It's a vital resource in the global AI community for evidence-based policymaking and debate, helping over 170 countries shape their national AI strategies and policies and create environments where trustworthy AI can flourish. The OECD and its partners created the platform to help implement the OECD AI principles for innovative and human-centric AI that respects human rights and democratic values. OECD.AI measures our collective progress towards trustworthy AI. Its interactive dashboards are a unique source of real-time data that provide insight into current AI developments. They include data about where cutting-edge AI research is taking place and how many women are conducting that research which AI skills workers have in a given country and how they match the skills required for the AI jobs that are available and who's moving where. What are the most popular types of AI software development, platforms and libraries? It shows AI news and events by country as they happen. It shows who is investing in AI startups and where and of course what those startups do. Another key feature of OECD.AI is a database of national AI policies from over 60 countries. This repository allows policymakers to compare their own policy ideas to those of their peers and to share good practices. OECD.AI has the support of an international network of over 200 AI experts. Their profiles are diverse, covering a wide range of disciplines and sectors. Its core mission is to share insights with the OECD by providing analysis and recommendations. The OECD.AI experts also add to the conversation around AI through contributions to OECD.AI's blog, The AI Wonk. The AI Wonk allows experts to share their unique perspectives and insights on how to make AI trustworthy and human-centric. Follow us on LinkedIn and subscribe to the AI Wonk blog.